So I want to do a quick video on the auto start functionality with uh, the system we have here. So to access the features of the auto engine start, you're going to click and go to the main menu here. And then we're going to click settings. And then you're going to scroll down to generator start stop. And then from here, you can turn the auto gen start on and off. Um, you can manually start it here by hitting the start generator. And you can tell it how many, how long to run it for if you want to set it to run 10 minutes or whatever. Um, you can also go to the settings. And in here, this is where you can turn on and off the quiet hours so it doesn't run when you have quiet hours. So you can set it here. Um, the main thing you want to look at is the conditions. So this is how you're going to get it to start and stop depending on what conditions you want to have. So usually we put it on battery state of charge, SOC. So if you click that, this is where you can tell it to turn on and off depending on what state of charge your battery is. So like right now, for instance, we have it to start when it gets lower than 30% and then stop when it gets to 40%. Um, but you can change it to, you know, whatever you want. You can go zero to a hundred percent or anything in between. Basically it's uh, kind of whatever you want, but that's how you do the, do it on battery state of charge, but you can also do it on other things like battery voltage or your AC loads. Like if you run more than, let's say, you know, 2000 Watts at once, it'll just kick the generator on. Um, and then you can just set it to different conditions here. Um, you can also get the generator turn on if the inverter gets hot, if the inverter gets overloaded, or you can even set it to periodically run every so often just to keep the generator exercised. So you can enable it here and set how many days you want it, how long you want it to run, and all kind of different conditions here. But that's the main thing with the auto gen start. So you set your conditions and then uh, you have minimum run time set your quiet hours when you want it to not work on quiet hours and then just turn it on here when you want those conditions to start the den so that's a quick tutorial on how to use the auto start function on the victron system